we are so much more than what we're sitting in. Some of us might not be able to speak. Some of us might not be able to move our arms or legs, but that doesn't mean that our minds are not intact. You should see some of the things that go on in this mind. Chris is just an incredible human. He is caring, compassionate. He's a family man. He loves his friends here. He loves the staff here. And he is just so multi-talented. He paints. He does digital. He writes dramatic plays that have been premiered. And he creates choreography as well. So there's so many layers to Chris. Arts Access is a way for me to express myself. There really are no limits to what I can do as an artist. If I want to drive my wheelchair in a, in a pool of paint and then dr drive on a canvas, I can do that. It just takes some tire cleanup afterwards, but that's about it. Arts Access is a fine arts program for people with disabilities. We offer complete freedom of artistic choice in the visual arts, the literary arts, or the performing arts and to create, most importantly, their art. The art that comes from their hearts, their souls, their minds, their imaginations. Arts Access takes away all of that other stuff and just allows us for a brief moment to see inside that artist. You going with the pink? Okay, so you want to continue using the pink. Danny's work is definitely unique. Every session is completely different from the next. She's worked with metal, wood, aluminum foil. She loves to use every part of her body too. There's one sculpture that you made and she used her, her inner thighs and her hands to crush the aluminum foil to get the shape that she was looking for. She inspires me every time we work together. She really has blossomed and become this amazing, amazing artist. Art comes from here. It doesn't come from here. The art that you're seeing is 100% theirs. Every single word, every single brush stroke, every single dance step is theirs. We don't guide, we don't lead. We're just there to let them let it out. It's one artist assisting another. Someone else may be performing it because that's what they want, but the dance belongs to them. The work that comes out of Arts Access is exceptional. It entertains us, it educates us, it inspires us. And everyone, regardless of a disability, should be able to experience that joy and be able to do that with dignity and independence. This is a boy named Christopher Robin. Named Christopher Robin is Pooh's best friend. With Chris, if he wants to work on his drawings, we get the supplies he needs ready, and he's pretty much good to go. And whether he's drawing or painting, a lot of it is straight from memory. This environment has been so positive for him, it's like he just thrived and has been drawing and coming up with different techniques and what he wants to do. And it makes him very proud that he too can say, I do this. What Arts Access does for them is profound and then what they give back to the world is equally profound. They're able to sell their original art, publish their poetry and sell the books, perform their work on stages throughout the county and the state. For our artists, maybe the only opportunity they ever have to make income from something they've created themselves. Priceless. Art impacts every person every day, and it's the one common denominator that we all have. As long as you're expressing yourself, that's a beautiful thing because nobody can say that's good art, that's bad art, because it's your art. Arts Access is a place that I think every parent should look to and say, I think there's something inside my daughter and I, I don't know how to get it out, but maybe they can. We offer choice, and choice equals freedom. They've lived with a disability their entire lives and their identity can be so tied up with that because much of their day revolves around that. Here they're artists and they know it. And we get to offer that to folks who don't have that in their daily lives. I have cerebral palsy, um, but the one thing that I like to say to people is I have a disability. The disability doesn't have me. 
It's never had me, it never will have me. And that's something I've learned from working with Arts Access. They, again, there really are no limits to what I can do as an individual.